autism. My brother is in love with Nicki Minaj, the pop star. He knows all the words to her songs. He knows all the dance moves from her video clips. He is six years old and just like Nicki Minaj's song, Starships were meant to fly. Sometimes it's easier to think that my brother is an alien from another world. You see, my brother has autism. Autism is a disability that affects the brain. Christopher was born with autism and even worse, there is no cure. Did you know one in 110 children have autism? Autism comes from the Greek word which means by yourself. It is often said that autistic people live in their own world. Christopher looks like he would die. If you saw him, you would just think he's your average, younger, pain in the neck, little brother. But Christopher's different. Christopher's special. <coughs> people with autism have trouble dealing in three main areas. The first area is trouble connecting with people. Christopher finds it hard to make friends. And when he does, keeping these friends is even harder. He finds it hard to understand sharing with others. He even laughs when he sees others cry. He's not a mean person. He just gets confused and sometimes can't tell the difference between sad and happy. The second area is delayed language and communication. Christopher did not start talking until he was two and a half. And even then, it was only one or two words at a time. <coughs> even now he gets nervous and panics talking to people he does not know. He doesn't stay on the right topic and usually ends up talking about Super Mario and of course Nicki Minaj. The third area is repetition, always doing the same things over and over again. At the age of two, Christopher was obsessed with the colour yellow. It was obviously his favourite colour. He would only eat the yellow jelly beans, he would only build with the yellow blocks and he would always want to wear his yellow t-shirts. Christopher loves routine and hates surprises. Many autistic people also have trouble dealing with their senses, touch, smell and hearing. Christopher doesn't like to eat certain foods because they feel funny in his mouth. Next time you see a child kicking and screaming in the middle of a shopping centre, it may not mean that they are being spoiled brat, but maybe the lights are too bright, maybe the noises are too loud, Maybe they have autism. There are lots of things that really worry me as his big brother. I also hate him kids getting bullied at school for doing silly things. Christopher does lots of silly things and it scares me to think that other kids might laugh at him, be cruel and even bully Christopher for being different. I wish I was there for him. I will always worry about my little brother. Even with all the therapies, special education, love and family support. Christopher will always be my quirky little brother who sometimes talks and acts like he's from Mars. Today, we felt with a really good prepared speech and a really good impromptu speech was able to elaborate on the points that this person made. And that person is Tash. Oh. spoke obviously about something that's really important to him and somebody who's really important to him and you know as an adjudicator it's lovely for us to hear the passion that came out in Tash. Don't make me cry, I'm crying too. It was a lovely speech. His mum very upset. Oh, it, was, oh, it was really, really lovely and it's so lovely to see how important your little brother is to you Tash and that you can speak so beautifully about him. And you even managed to bring him in to your friend's topic. And that was lovely, that he's your special friend. Well done. 
So, congratulations to the other four speakers, and we're going to award you with a commended medal here. And Mrs. Larkin, we'd like to spot them for you. Here you go. So, first of all,